You guys, I don't really know what just happened, but all I know is these sneakers skyrocketed in resale almost overnight. And I really wish that I had been watching these a little bit closer because these things absolutely went up hundreds of dollars almost instantly. And I don't even know what happened. Always remember you guys, take care of yourself, take care of each other, tell somebody you love them today. Like I love you guys. I always remember no matter what you guys are going through, at the end of the day, the day's gonna end. Let's go ahead, let's get into this video. Yeah, yeah, he got kicks. But like switch, but like switch. I don't miss. Don't do bricks. Don't do bricks. He got kicks. The kid is sick. The kid is Team with raw rock, cause he got hits. He got kicks. What is up, YouTube? I'm He Got Kicks. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, there we got notifications every time I drop one of these bangers for you guys. Hit the like button, hit the share button, do all those great things for me. Follow me on Instagram at the real he got kicks, and of course the hat page perfect brims and TikTok he got kicks 95. Shout out to today's commenters, man. Appreciate you guys being positive in the comment section, engaging with the content, making this a safe place for sneakerheads to come talk and just chill. But you guys, today's video, what we are talking about is a couple sneakers that honestly I didn't know that they actually shot up so fast like literally almost overnight and these things right here used to actually not go for near as that and people used to be able to get them for very affordable prices uh, except for exception of a couple uh, but we're of course going to use Arbit. Arbit of course is an app that of course brings value to every single sneaker. They take every third party marketplace that they have on the app. They have StockX, eBay, Go, Kicks Crew, Kicksify, and of course working on a couple others as well to of course bring you guys something called an Arbit value for every single sneaker. That is where you will bring in all of these together and it will come up with a, with a right price for each sneaker that you can have. You'll have a high, you'll have a low, you'll have exactly where it usually will sit in between and that will be where they think is a good price to buy this shoe. Now, of course, we are using this for this video as well because these things right here absolutely shot up and I want to talk about each and every one of these sneakers. And they even have something to where if I would have been watching these where you can actually sign in, create an account, watch these sneakers and it'll let you know how the market fluctuates with them, which I should have been smart and done that myself, but I wasn't. But again, I'll make sure you guys download Arbit. It is a free app. All you have to do just, of course, hit that link in the description box down below. They have iOS, they have Android, everything. Check them out. And they even have something called an Arbit Insight. It'll let you guys know within the next 30 days, is the sneaker gonna go up or is it gonna go down? And all these sneakers, unfortunately, we're talking about today are going up in the next 30 days. And it seems like quite a bit. So that sucks, but it is what it is. That's just part of the sneaker game. But we are gonna be talking talking about, of course, some Travis Scott sneakers. And of course, I did not think that these went up that much. They were literally like $600, $700, $800, and now they are all almost into the mid thousands. So that is absolutely crazy. Like if you look at, of course, the first one we're gonna go over is the Air Jordan 1 Travis Scott Low Black Phantom. That sneaker I got for $600. That was literally brand new, everything. Right now, the Arbit value is $903. And of course, if you look at you know StockX, the lowest ask is $969. eBay is $709, so that is good. So you can go on eBay, get a better deal. Uh, but Kicks, Kicksify is $995, so they're sitting right there at $1,000. And you know, a goat, it's a goat, it is over a thousand. It's a thousand and sixty-eight dollars for the black phantoms, which is insane. Now, if you look at the next one, the olive, the women's olive in my size nine and a half, Arbit values 917. They actually were right around six, seven hundred dollars before. So they have gone up and they are likely going up according to Arbit to sit right around the thousand ninety-two dollars in the next 30 days. I don't know what happened, you guys. I have no clue what happened. It seems like now this does always happen with Travis Scott sneakers, but I don't know what happened to make all of the low tops all just shoot up in price. It was absolutely insane. Now, if you even look at the Canaries that just came out, Arbit values 462 on them. StockX, it's a little bit better, 400. You know, if you look at Kixify, it's really high at right around 590. 
GOAT 435, so it's just a little bit under the Arbit value. So you're seeing good, good deals right there. But now if you look at the reverse Mocha, I bought that sneaker. I bought that one for $1,000 and the Arbit value now is $1,433 on stock X. The lowest ask is $1,683. And it's projected to go up even more from $1,433 to $1,758 in the next 30 days. That is just absolutely insane. It seems like every one of these went up. Even the golf shoes are at $1,000 now. And I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. These sneakers literally shot up, it seems like, overnight. I'm just super, super curious at what you guys think happened. Like this market, yeah, I figured that everything would stay low. And, but I, I don't know. Like, you know, somebody said because he went to jail, I, I doubt that made his sneakers go up I, I get, could but i highly doubt that it did so i'm just really curious what do you guys think actually happened to this market to make these sneakers go up now again a lot of us like these shoes not everybody likes them that's fine not every shoes for everybody but these definitely have a market and they definitely were not near as high as what they are now. So I'm just definitely, definitely curious at everything that is going on because this right here was a huge jump and it seems like within a matter of days, all of these sneakers were thousand dollar sneakers when they were literally just like mid hundreds. I don't know what happened. I'm really, really curious what you guys think. Let me know in the comment section down below and again, this is just something that I think is really cool to actually be able to see and watch sneakers on Arbit and just kind of see which ones you're looking at, when might be the best time to buy. And I feel like we have all missed, if you really wanted Travis Scott lows, we have all missed that. And again, we have a lot more low tops coming out as you know, we thought that there was gonna be the end of that. There's a lot more scheduled to come out. You know, we do have one in September. We've got one, I think in holiday season. So we have a lot more that are coming back out, but I definitely feel think that we have all passed up on the time to get those Travis Scott lows. Absolutely crazy. I'm glad that there's some of them I bought at the perfect time. I bought some early and the early purchase is now a good purchase. So I'm kind of happy with that, but who knows? But again, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think happened. And again, hey, this might not be for everybody, but again, I'm just kind of curious what your guys' opinions are on that market and what could have happened to cause it. And again, man, download Arbit. It is a free app. It is in the description box down below. You guys already know how to do it. And of course, man, hey, let them know that I sent you and make sure you guys create that account. That way you can start watching the sneakers that you guys want to purchase. And as always, you guys take care of yourself, take care of each other, tell somebody you love them today like I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.